Welcome to the student information update process. In this video, we'll guide you through the steps to ensure your child's student information is up to date. Before we begin, make sure you have received a letter containing important information that will assist you throughout this process. Having it ready will make your journey smoother. Let's dive in. The letter you receive provides the necessary information to create your account. If you need additional assistance, visit the Modesto City Schools website at www.mcsforkids.com. Navigate to the Parents section, select Tech Help Center, and locate the how-to tutorials for creating a PowerSchool Parent Portal account. The next screen will prompt you to verify the birth date of your child. Enter the requested information to proceed. This leads you to an introduction to the student information portal, providing an overview of the process. Click next when you're ready to begin. On the following pages, you'll provide relevant information for your student. Some fields are required and marked with a tag. As you enter data, additional options may appear based on your entries. In the contact section, be sure to include yourself and any other parent or legal guardian and emergency contacts for your student. You can enter up to seven contacts in total. When entering your contacts, do not worry about the order in which they appear. You will specify contact priority in the next step. Enter any pertinent medical information for your student, including the option to specify a family doctor. In the Health History section, enter any medical condition the student may have. If the condition requires a student to take medication at school, check the indicated box. Then be sure to add the medication itself as a separate health condition by clicking the box to add another health condition. This ensures that both the condition and the medication are properly documented. Read through the Agreements page, then click Next to proceed. In the Document Upload section, submit necessary documents like birth certificates and immunization records. Tooltips in each section provide details on specific requirements. Please note that the process is not complete until all required documents have been provided to the school. If you cannot upload documents at this time, check the designated box to proceed with the form. Be sure to follow up with the school to ensure any missing documents are submitted as soon as possible. Complete the document upload and click Next to reach the signature page. Sign the form digitally to move on to the final summary page. The final page offers a visual overview of your form status, highlighting any errors. Click on specific sections to address and correct issues. As you finalize the necessary updates, click the Submit button to complete the form. The final page will display a disclaimer ensuring that all submitted documentation will be reviewed by our site staff. The Next Steps section can provide guidance on post-submission procedures. Should you require assistance, feel free to contact the school with the contact information shown on the page. Once you've completed the process, don't forget to select Save and Sign Out, especially if you're using a public computer. Congratulations on successfully completing the form. We look forward to welcoming your student here at Modesto City Schools, where every student matters and every moment counts.